Hello everybody, my name is Mahmoud Tazmanov and I'm from Computer Engineering Department. And today I'm going to talk about uh, advantages of big data in targeted marketing. Uh, but before moving into my topic, I want to ask you a question. What is big data? Well, uh, this is a pretty vague term that everybody likes to use nowadays. But, in fact, big data is a relatively simple term. It is some big data, and that's a big chunk of data that you need to analyze before using it. So, why is it advantageous? Uh, first of all, it is really easy to obtain. There are numerous ways of uh, having your big data. And, secondly, it's effective to use. And, really, if you have big data, you will get very much uh, too many useful information from it. Uh, do you use discount cards, like uh, from the Decathlon or Clinical Tourism? Uh, the only reason why, you, why they are giving you this discount card is not just because they want to make you a loyal customer, but uh, they also take your information uh, every time you uh, put your card into the uh, when you use the card at checkout. And that's one way to get your information. The second is online retailers. Uh, it, I don't know if you shop from Trendyol, Amazon, or uh, any other online sites, but when you buy from them, you have to give a very valuable information to them uh, and that is your home address and they can um, match your home address with the product that you bought and uh, get a really nice map about where most people buy um, coffee machines and maybe they can, uh, when they want to open a coffee store, they can use this information to open their uh, shop in the perfect place. So, second thing I want to talk about is accessing to big data. Uh, there's two ways to get it, using your own co company's own data or outsourcing data. So, how big is the big data? Well, according to McAfee, Walmart is estimated to create 2.5 petabytes of consumer data every hour. Well, this number might not mean something to you. Uh, one petabyte is equal to 20 million traditional filling cabinets of text. So, think about 20 million of uh, traditional filling cabinets and uh, this is insane amount of data that, is, can, that cannot be analyzed by human power. And uh, if you are uh, worried about uh, having your own data, you can always go to Periscope Data, in data Lab, or such companies to use their own data that they have uh, gathered from a lot of ways. So how to utilize the big data? So uh, first, it lets you know to get to know your target market, and secondly, it lets you adjust your prices. So this is the screenshot that I took from Amazon. Well, as, uh, as you know, uh, the Friday uh, is Black Friday, and the, uh, the things that they have to put in their front store is really important. As, as you can see, there is an Nintendo Switch console that is not sold in Turkey, and if you check, uh, the sale of Nintendo Switch is really high on Turkey due to the fact that Nintendo is not available in Turkey, they don't have official retail store. Or please take a look at this secret shot that I took from Walmart. Uh, they do have gaming consoles too, but um, as you know, Walmart is an American company and they only have uh, PlayStation 4. So, to conclude, uh, the big data is a really powerful tool that uh, that determines the winner of the uh, marketing uh, war. So here is my reference. If you have any questions, I'll go take it. Thank you very much.